If you're thinking about selling your house, aren't you curious about how much that's gonna cost? Selling your house is stressful when you think about packing and unpacking and getting to know the new neighborhood, but what's more stressful is not knowing what it's gonna cost you. Hi, I'm Sonia Flores with Faith and Vision Realty, and what I wanna walk you through today is what it costs to sell your home. Okay, knowing your cost upfront will allow you to have the upper hand in negotiating because you will know your bottom line. The most important number is not the sale price, is the number that you walk away with. The first cost we'll talk about is title insurance. Title insurance guarantees a clear title when you sell your property. This can cost from 1,000 to maybe two or 3,000 depending on the property we are selling. So knowing your title cost is very important upfront when you're looking at numbers. Now let's go to cost number two, which is escrow. Escrow is your neutral partner. They make sure that all the monies come in. They make sure you have clear title. They make sure they deal with the lender. They deal with the realtors. They deal with pretty much title and everybody involved. So they're the neutral for the buyer and the seller, the neutral party. And that cost can come from 900 to maybe 3,000 depending where the property is and how much the property is selling for. Another cost you're gonna see on your statement is tax prorations. In the state of California, you are responsible for your taxes on the home up to the date that you sell your home. So whatever is sold before that, that's gonna show on your statement also. For example, if you have a tax bill of $10,000 and you close mid-year, well, your tax preparation is gonna be anything before that that hasn't been paid. The next item you're gonna see on your closing statement is what you owe on your home. So let's say you sell it for 500,000, but you still owe 300,000. Well, you're gonna show 300,000 coming out on your closing statement. It's a good idea to know what your balance is so that the closing, you have a good idea of what your final number is going to be. The next cost is going to be your realtor's commission if you plan to utilize a realtor to sell your home. Typically, the commission is between 5 and 6% of the sale of your home. And that kind of depends on the package that you choose when you um, choose a realtor. When you're selling your house, there's a lot of things involved. Pictures, marketing, um, staging, it just depends where you're at, what's in your home, what's not in your home helping you to get that home ready for the sale. There's just a lot of things involved in selling your home. But on top of that, there's still a lot of other stuff that's done behind the scenes, and that's showings, that's coordinating inspections with inspectors, appraiser, um, also even getting, sometimes getting um, subcontractors to maybe fix the plumbing that they want fixed or the lighting or whatever it is. There's a lot that entails that, do, that does cost money. So I hope this video gave you a good idea of the cost that it entails when selling your property. When I'll light it up, this cost comes to about six to 8% of the sale of your home. If you would like to have a seller's net sheet of the exact dollar amount of closing your home, give us a call, we're here to help and we can get that to you. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it helps. This is Sonia Flores with Faith and Vision Realty.